Hello guys, I welcome you all on this wonderful platform that is Baiju's exam prep and today I am here in front of you once again with a very important news notification. So guys, as you know, Engineering Services 2024 exam, uh, just yesterday was the last day to fill the form and today they have released the timetable of the exam. Uh, you can see that timetable, you know that ESC exam is held in the three stages. In the stage one, there is a preliminary exam where two papers are there. One is for general uh, studies, second is for uh, technical and then mains exam is there and that mains exam, whoever is going to qualify in that, then you are having interview. So first you need to qualify prelims, then mains and then interview. Generally mains is there in the May and okay. So let us see the prelims timetable. So guys, you can see uh, this is 18th of February. Like now they have fixed it after the gate. Previously they were taking in January, but from last uh, last year also, this year also, previous to that also they have fixed it after gate. So gate will be completed in first and second weekend. Then in the third third weekend of February, on Sunday 18th of February 2024, 10 a.m. to 12, there will be general studies and engineering aptitude paper, where you know engineering aptitude, mathematics, and there are other subjects like project management, material science, energy and environment, ethics, current affairs, all these are there, etc, etc. Then there will be 2 to 5 p.m. technical paper, civil, mechanical, electrical, electronics and tele telecommunication. Okay, this is 3 hours, 300 marks, this is 2 hours, 200 marks, rest you know, here 100 questions are there, here 150 questions are there, 2 marks each. And guys, they have mentioned the branch codes also, like you know, for civil, this is, for paper 1, it is 01, and for civil objective paper is 11. For this is common, for electrical 3 1, for mechanical it is 2 1, for uh, ET it is, four, it is 4 1. So guys, this is a common thing which is there and one more information I would like to tell you. As you already know, they have given the tentative vacancy that 167, which is the less number compared to previous years obviously. And last year also they have increased the vacancy after some days. So we are hoping that this year also such kind of thing happened and they increase the vacancy. But from one of the student side, I got this sheet uh, where for civil and mechanical, there is some bifurcation of the seats are there. For civil, 69 seats uh, are there. For mechanical, 12 seats are there. So you can see uh, department wise also like central engineering services, civil engineering post, total are 5. And uh, then border road engineering 24, and then defense services uh, 21. Then you can see MES surveyor 10 and then India skill development is 3, central motor is 6, total 69. For mechanical, we have like uh, geological survey of India is 2, defense service is 3, naval is 3, central motor 1, defense aeronautical quality is 3, total are 12. I know very less seats are there and they must be increased. But guys, this is the information, this video is to just pass on the information what we have. So guys, uh, goodbye for this particular video. And hope uh, you guys will be always there with us. Just stay tuned with us. We will be always coming with all the information which are required for you related to form filling, required related to anything. And also you are having some good quality, technical as well as generic video on this channel. So stay tuned with us. Goodbye for this particular video.